Okay, I know I look crazy, but on my way to Columbia. Yay! To get my teeth done. The rules is they have, you have to have a mask on, which is really annoying, but we still doing this COVID thing. See you guys soon. I actually contacted in 2017. Look at that. It's 2023. So, this is a one. So honestly, right now I'm just gonna try to space it out. The crazy thing about this journey is that I know you guys are probably like, what? You're doing this by yourself. I'm a wild, crazy person. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. I started wearing wifey nails. What's I consider wifey nails? They say it's wifey nails. I started wearing French tip because I want to be a wife. So I started wearing French tips. You guys can see. Started wearing French tips. Passenger to need to declare goods or currency to the Colombian Customs Authority the and shall request the 534. That means I knew that mean before I even seen it. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, first of all, a little thing you guys are gonna know about me, I wear glasses. <laughs> your glasses, your passport, debit card, some cash, and your cell phone. Solo trip, we're unstoppable. Oh yeah, and the mask, cause they don't play with the mask. That's why I look ridiculous with these glasses and the mask. I don't know what to do, guys, but um, I'm going to go ask some help. How do you say help in Spanish? Okay. I guess this is for your help. Hi. Hi. I just came off the flight. Where are you going? And I'm going to Cali, Colombia. Uh, first immigration, the green line. I have okay. to go immigration line. Okay. Yeah. Thank nice you. Play. Okay, so I guess I have to go to immigration line. Let's go. These are the things people don't show you or tell you when they have a YouTube video. They don't. Okay, clearly I'm 
Am I the only one that gets lost? <laughs> it's like a maze. This is the immigration line, and if I don't pass this part, you don't come into the country. Do you understand? Every time I think of Colombia, I think of the movie Colombiana. Okay. I'm out of breath, y'all. Oh. Well, they asked for my vaccination card. Thankfully, I have a vaccination card. Shout outs to having a vaccination card. All right, this trip has made me realize how important it is to have everything the COVID vaccination card, everything. Like, Stuff that we laughed at, like, well, who's getting a vaccination card? But they don't, I don't think you can come in without one into this country. So, if you guys want to think about getting your teeth done, I'm not sure if you need a vaccination card or you might need a COVID test or either or, but they're not playing, okay? And they don't play with the mask either. That's why I look ridiculous. The good thing about booking with Dr. Mario Montoya is that he gives you a link to fill out everything he tells you, everything you need to come to Colombia. He tells you everything. He does everything for you. So I honestly feel like you get what you pay for. You understand? So I'm on the immigration line. It's really long. And see you guys in a little bit. I don't know if they're going to allow me to record or vlog past this point. It's hot. I have a long sleeve. I have a long sleeve. Put black into it. It's like 80 degrees out here. So this is why you do not run for flights. And this is why you don't do connected flights. I'm sweating like crazy. Look a mess. I know I look a mess. I just land and I'm in Cali, Colombia. Oh my god, I think I see my drivers. This is the mall that the doctor have his office inside. He's on the seventh floor. Isn't this, this mall so beautiful? We're in Colombia. My driver is right here. He has my luggage. I'm just getting like pizza. I don't know. Something quick. I'm starving. That looks amazing. I don't know that. It looks like cheesecake. I'm so hungry right now, y'all. Yeah. This is in the mall, inside of uh, the mall where he's, his office is. So, this is inside the mall. And it's so nice. Again, my driver. I gotta be here at 7 a.m. So, yeah. 
So I just got into the room. Oh my God, y'all. I just got into the room. It's dark. And the lights on. Oh my God, I think that I had to literally. Oh, y'all. You gotta keep the key in in order for the light to stay on. I feel like I always wanna show the bathroom first. So let me show the bathroom. I'm starving. Wow. You guys should see this bathroom. Wow. Look at this shower. It's so big. It's beautiful. It's the toilet, which I love, because guess what? No one used it. See? Oh my. Look at this tub. It looks like a jacuzzi. It looks like a, it looks like a pool. It's indoor pool, y'all. Oh, and it come with the bubble bath. This is so amazing. This is like five star. Like, this is nice. This is beautiful. This room is so spacious. It's outside. I'm tired, I'm really tired and my appointment is at 7 a.m. I'm going to take a shower and then I'm going to come back and talk to you guys about more things. I feel so good. I took a shower. I thank God that I'm safe. I went and did my x-ray for my teeth. I made some payments, filled out paperwork. The team, the customer service is A1. I didn't feel uncomfortable so far for day one. I'm um, doing payments and paperwork. They were very, very, very patient. Like any questions I had, they answered. They, if, even if I wanted to see the price difference, they wrote down, they explained. Ooh, yeah. You really get what you pay for. You get great, great, great customer service. And day one, for me getting there extremely late, I got there really late, by the way. I'll tell y'all in part two or part three. I'll tell y'all why I was late, but it'll probably be in this description box below. It will definitely be in the description box below. Part one, part two, part seven, part 25. Just kidding. But... It was just like a really, really stressful day, but not with them, just the airlines and being able to just be around people who made you feel real calm and not hectic. It was very easy. It felt natural, very authentic. I love it. I'm so tired. I don't know what to do, but I gotta take off this makeup. I definitely do because it is 10.30. Why did iPhone just do that? It is 10.30 p.m. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do to my hair because my hair texture is not blending with this leave out. I just gotta go to bed because I really feel like a spoiled princess right now because I'm about to have my tea done in the morning at 7 a.m. Yeah, my appointment is at 7 a.m. So I'm gonna wake up at 5.45. Wish me luck. I'm nervous. I'm really nervous for tomorrow. Be nervous. It's, it's gonna go good. I mean, the root canal. I mean, but you've had those before. Gotta go, y'all, because he's selling my business. Gotta go. Oh my god. Mm. Oh my gosh. Good morning. 